Hey, what's up? This is Martha D. Styles, owner of MDMC Entertainment. And today I wanted to do a video. Um, ironically, well, I didn't want to do a video, actually. I got all done up to do some pictures for content. And I didn't want to waste the look. Um, this is something I have not worn in public yet. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> Figured I'd do it now. Um, so I did a blog a while back. Uh, probably about a month ago or so. And it was titled, Be a Disruptor, Your Haters Will Hate will hate It. And it's true. Your haters will absolutely hate if you are jumping into a territory. And, you know, you have a good idea. You have a good business plan. You know that your content will work or your strategy will work to gain an audience or to gain business. And the funny thing is, is that a lot of people in the business world get too complacent when it comes to their business. Once something is working, they don't tend to um, move it forward in a way to grow. People just get complacent. They're like, if it's broke, don't fix it. So they will not touch their business in helping it grow. And I think one of the things that is very interesting, especially from what I have seen with my experience, is that when you jump into something and you happen to be good at it, a lot of people will not like that. It's just a common thing. It's just people just don't like it. Um, I don't know why. <laughs> I think it's because they see um, they see this competition and they know that if you're doing something different that they are doing or they are not doing, it's going to disrupt the natural order of the world. And I think it's kind of funny because, you know, everyone will complain and sit there and be like, well, my business isn't growing. My business isn't doing this. My business isn't doing that. Well, what are you doing to help it? Are you putting in, you know, some sort of, you know, key components that could change things up? Are you actively trying or are you just sitting back and complaining? There's a lot of things that, you know, most people, most business owners will do and they'll just sit there and complain that nothing's working. Well, it's not because you're not trying. <laughs> and then when you see a new kid on the block, and they're doing good, and you wanna copy what they're doing, here's the thing that I've learned a long time ago. True to me, true to anybody that's out there. If you see somebody that's out there doing something and they're doing really good at it, and you try to copy it, truth is, two people doing the same thing will never equal the same result. It's just not possible. Sorry, not gonna happen. And it's because there is people work differently and if you think that copying someone who's successful in this arena is going to help you be successful in your arena it's probably not going to happen yes you can do some variations yes you can probably get ahead a little bit but it just doesn't work and so um being a disruptor you know and you get into a niche or you get into you know um, a competitive space and you just happen to be good at it well, guess what? You're going to be good at it. So it is what it is. Be a disruptor. Your haters will hate it. And um, if you want to check out the blog, it is on the MDMC website under the blog section. Um, there's a couple of other things that are in there as well. I'm trying to figure out what I want to write versus what I want to do with video. I'm creating my content calendar right now. One of the things that I really suck at and probably other employees or employers could tell you is that I'm really bad at planning. I have a list of things, I just haven't put it into specific dates. And you know why I don't like to do that? And maybe this is something from childhood. <laughs> I'm trying to think, I have a lot of issues. And I, I tend to think like maybe there's, you know, certain things that have caused me to think a certain way. But one of the reasons why I don't plan things is because things always change. It doesn't matter how far in advance you plan, sometimes shit just doesn't work out. Um, but I'm trying to get better at that because I know that's a weakness of mine. So um, in my phone and my notes, I actually have a list of things that um, the topics that I want to cover via either if it was written or video form. And since I was already, you know, done up already, I figured I'd just run up here and do the quick video. So if you are a disruptor in your in your field, in your niche, in your competitive pool, and people don't like that you're disrupting the natural order of things, you're doing something right. And that's when you know when, um, when the heat comes on, 
then you know you're doing something right. <laughs> Alright, this was such an impromptu video. I kind of stumbled on this one, sorry. But here it is on IGTV. I hope you guys enjoy it, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.